Hello everyone, my name is Tammy, and today I'm going to tell you a little bit about my past, present, and future. This is probably my seventh time trying to record this, so hopefully this time works. Um, so I'm going to start with my present. Presently, um, I'm in this class, Communications, as a prerequisite, as probably everyone else in this class is. So all I can say is this class is going to reflect my presence, public speaking for college and career. Also, presently, um, I'm living with my daughter. Uh, she's almost 14. She's in eighth grade, and she's fantastic. Here's an older picture of her when she was, I think, about six. Um, she just is a well-rounded girl. She's into sports. She's got good grades, as all of us can talk on and on and on about our children. She's pretty fantastic. Um, I don't think that we can look at our present without looking into our past. And when I tried to come up with one particular item that reflected my past, it was really difficult. So when I was walking through my bedroom, I thought, photo albums. They kind of capture everything from your family, which is your foundation, to your experiences, be it travel or other times in your life, to friends, to different events that shape and, and mold your character. So I chose photo albums to represent my past. Um, and as far as the future goes, um, a couple years ago I had a series of events that really shook my own personal foundation that made me reflect upon myself and to where I was going and what I was doing with myself and how that affected the people around me. And I realized that I was extremely rigid, more more so really wound tight. I was living off of a checklist, which means that everything had to be um, written down, and then I'd check it off as we, we would do it and accomplish it. And I realized I wasn't living in the moment. And so to look at the future, I really don't know what the future holds for me. So I drew this very silly and simple infinity sign because I feel that at this day, um, my future is full of in, infinite possibilities, and I just haven't quite fulfilled them yet. And so I just pride myself and try to live for the moment and appreciate the moment that we're in and be authentic to myself, to my family, and to everyone else around me. I wish everyone else really good luck this semester, and please bear with me as I work with this technology stuff because it's very foreign to me, but I'm living in the moment and trying to be really patient with it. So thank you everyone and have a great day.